Kwa maana ikiwa kama wewe yuko kwa kiwanjani ya mpira kama wewe unacheza unadhani wewe ndio unajua kushinda watu wapi Siko watu wengine huko nje baba anasema ah nilidi hapa na pega kule kwa nini yeye hapa na pega kule kwa hivyo ukitiwaambia ati jaribu kuangalia kule na kule na kule tena ufanye umoja hii ndio tuzasaidia hii ni Luo Archive TV, televisheni inayoangazia siasa, uchumi na mila katika jamii la Luo hapa njini Kenya. Karibu tena mpendwa. Pia unaweza kutupata kwa mitandao ya jamii. Facebook ni Luo Archive TV. Instagram ni Luo Archive TV. Na Twitter ni Luo Archive TV. Tunarejea kwa muda usio kwa mrefu. Hello viewers, welcome back. It was 6 a.m. on a foggy Thursday, 20th of January 1994. We woke up to the news on Kenya Broadcasting Corporation (KBC) Swahili service, the only radio station in Kenya by then. The headline was Jaramogi Oginga Odinga Miaga Dunia. That was the saddest news on earth. Here are some of Jaramogi's memorable speeches. Na tunataka nyinyi kuangalia hii serikali. Tena kuwa na roho ya kuangalia serikali hii watu wapana chafua chafua pande huu pande huu. Usikubali kwa watu kuchafua serikali. Na usikubali kwa serikali aende kando. Ikiwa kama unaona sisi tuko na kasino sema wasi hapana haya hapana kaa kimya. Utasema tu kwa sauti ya wale watu wenu ambao iko katika parliament. Kwa maana ikiwa kama wewe yuko kwa kiwanjani ya mpira kama wewe unacheza, unadhani wewe ndio unajua kushinda watu wote. Siko watu wengine huko nje baba anasema ah, kwa nini hapa napiga kule? Kwa nini yeye hapa napiga kule? Kwa hivyo ukitiwaambia ati jaribu kuangalia kule na kule na kule tena ufanye umoja hii ndio tuzasaidia. Mr. Odinga, it is evident that you are opposing President Jomo Kenyatta who supports the West. Why do you have strong link with the East countries like the USSR, China and Cuba? You even named your grandson after Cuban President Fidel Castro. Why are you pro East? Well, I should tell you whether western connection and so on. I'm brought up in a western atmosphere. I, as Ogingo Dinga, my education was paid up for by a Britisher. And I'm most grateful for all these things that they do for me. But when it comes to national cause, I must toward the line which is best for the general masses of our country. What do you have to say about President Kenyatta's allegation at, at a public uh, meeting on Sunday that you had bribed some former forest fighters to go back to the forest and organize a terrorist movement? But this thing in the first place, anybody who sees it should have seen that it is, it is fabricated. Anybody who, any intelligent man who has got any brain at all, could see that it is fabricated. Because 150,000 pounds, <laughs> imagine, even me as a Ngo I have never imagined having a lump sum of money of 150,000 pounds anywhere. Do you get money from Fominix? Uh, no, don't tell me. I am not going actually to, 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 to say that I get money. I have told you that I get money, I will get money from anybody who is prepared to give it to me, provided I know that other people also get money. It's in public domain that you are not in good relationship with the president. Why this hatred between you and President Jomo Kenyatta? Do you see yourself smarter than him? Jomo Kenyatta is the father of the African nationalism and the African national movement in this country. We cannot be 
we cannot in any sense be more advanced than our teacher and master, whom I think is much more advanced in political outlook in this country than we are. We are still in just in the stages of learning politics from him. Which stories do you want us to cover? Let us know. Luo Archives, keeping our history alive. Subscribe to Luo Archives TV so that we bring more hidden history.